Three students at Canyon Crest Academy are working on a documentary to bring awareness to younger students about COVID-19 testing and the need to wear a mask and social distance. We're talking to a few of the students behind the film, Nico Maccioni, Sanjana Zambwani, and Nicholas Dashi. Did I get that all correct? That was perfect. Thank you. <laughs> perfect. Well, thank you guys for joining us uh, early. I hope we're not keeping you from school just yet. But Nico, I'll start with you. Tell us a little bit about this project and how it came to be. Yeah, of course. So, so John and Nick and I, uh, along with Ready Children's Hospital, we're currently working on a project called the COVID Collaborative for Children's Project. And our main goal is to really simply just help prevent the spread of COVID-19. And we really intend to do so by informing those our age of the proper safety precautions, such as wearing a mask, properly washing your hands um, and socially distancing, and then also getting tested if you happen to have any symptoms or have been in contact with anyone that has had COVID-19 and how really simply these simple steps, it could go a long way to help prevent the spread of COVID-19. And so, Jana, I understand there was an opportunity to interview some of the doctors and nurses and health professionals at Rady Children's. What was your takeaway from that? Was there anything that you really learned that was surprising to you? Yeah, thank you, Lauren. I think it was a really, really incredible experience. We went in last Saturday and we just got to see the entire process. We started with getting tested. We followed our test into the lab and we got to talk to the doctors there and just learn like, what actually happens to a COVID test. And then we went from there to the ER and we even went to the PQ. So we really got to talk to all the doctors and nurses in the area. And we even got to talk to Dr. Bradley, who I believe has been on KUSI many times. And yes. I think we, it was very insightful. And we just got to know a lot of information that we're, we're ready to share with the public um, very soon. And so Nicholas, I, part of this, uh, this documentary was really in an effort to get more young people tested. Uh, what, are, what are you hoping to accomplish? Is it just to increase the testing of, of younger people as part of a, a campaign to sort of know more? Or what's, what's the mission behind the documentary? I mean, I personally believe the mission behind the documentary is more to educate people ages 10 through 19 about COVID-19 and health precautions that they can take in order to help the prevent the spread. Although they aren't directly in a life-threatening position as the virus may not kill them, they could put other people at risk. So we believe that it's important that everyone is aware of the health precautions and that they should take certain measures in order to help prevent the spread. So Nika, when is this going to be complete? How can people watch it? And, and was there a, a fun method that you took in order to help uh, really get the younger people interested in watching? Uh, yes, of course. So uh, right now, uh, we, we finished all the filming uh, just this past weekend. So it's really just down to like the production and the editing. So we're, we're almost done. Uh, we'll be publi uh, publishing it on both Instagram and YouTube. So if you'd like to see that, uh, the video on Instagram, it will be on our uh, Instagram page, covid.collaborative, uh, no spaces, no capitals. Uh, and then if you'd like to watch uh, the video on our YouTube, it is also covid.collaborative, no spaces, no capitals. Um, and um, we, we, we did bring in some jokes or uh, minor uh, comedy into our video to help entertain those our age. Uh, but uh, I think when teenagers watch it, they'll have a fun time when watching this video. Well, I commend you all for your efforts and your initiative on this front. I think it's going to do great things and, and hopefully help educate uh, in the process. So thank you all for joining us this morning. Keep up the great work, and I'm looking forward to seeing this. Uh, thank you for having us. Thank you. Absolutely. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> well, it